are with another designer playthrough of my game Rogue Fleet. And uh, there's a bunch of new features in this version of the game. The main one being that now there's a movement limit to how far you can move a ship in one turn. So that creates a lot more tactical concern than existed before. So um, let's squeeze through here. It's kind of a tight, tight squeeze. Let's see here. Get our warship up, uh, up here and get this. Ooh, yeah, big econ ship. Another feature you'll see here is we now have three different sizes of ships. You got small ships, you got medium and big. And the size of the ship determines its speed and also its um, hull and crew maximum as well as the maximum number of subsystems that it can carry. We're gonna finish off this guy. We've got this little guy here coming at us. Okay. And let's end this turn. Actually, can we get to scavenging this turn? Yes. Great. Now let's end the turn. Okay, a little board. Oh yeah, science ship. That's great. Get our harvester moving back to this Terran world. And end the turn. He cannot attack, so he didn't attack us, so he's not a warship at least. Okay, and let's go ahead and search station. Let's board you again. Keep salvaging. Alright. These guys don't have... Oh yeah, they're a science ship. Okay. Start that food harvesting going on out with three harvesters already. You're gonna see how awesome that large ship is at uh, gathering right from the get go. All right, jeez, they're still holding out. And we're salvaging. Okay, we finished off that salvage, and let's let's get a. Uh, Let's go ahead and get a repair on. First, let's scout this and see. Can I? No, I can't get up to that sea. I wanted to scout this ship, which you can now do by colliding with the ship. You can see what's on board of it. All right, mission accomplished. Let's get back here. You need crew now. You need repairs now. Anybody need repairs? He does. Well, he doesn't need it, but he can go up to 400 hull. You can have 400 hull or crew on a large ship. Alright, we'll keep, keep harvesting. Let's have you search that. Get back there. Search this station. And the turn. there to this action here. Not quite yet though. We need crew, buddy. Keep searching. Found nothing. Oh, we're making a lot of food. Look at this. It's going to go even higher than that. Okay, we're going to bore this little guy. And then we're going to get some crew. No. You're going to keep searching. You're gonna get some. Actually, part of me just wants to uh, not take this ship with us. Let's see. No, let's let's take the ship with us. Let's crew him up. You're in the way. Yeah, search. See that more interesting gameplay that comes about from that. You've gotta move things around, make sure that they fit, make the most out of your turn. Okay, 120 food. Yeah, let's, we're gonna try to get over a thousand food here. Definitely. 
Okay, we captured this ship. Destroyed factories. Yeah, let's offload this stuff onto. Uh, this. Yeah, give away your, fa your droid factories to them. And uh, we're also going to give away our crew. Got 10 crews, and there's still guys on that sh on board that station. We have a scavenger. Yeah, I'd rather you be scavenging these hulks that are out here. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, it's in the turn. Okay, we'll transfer this other droid factory and all that crew, and then we'll be good. Being sure to move this ship away so that it doesn't get caught up in our warp because we don't want to take it with us. Alright, we're getting metal from the Hulk now. That's happening. Alright, so you're done transferring all the droids. Start giving away the crew. Give crew. And we're still transferring crew off this station successfully. Let's uh, let's have this guy search the station. Cool, we got a ship. What does it have on it? Two miners and a skimmer. That's good stuff. Let's give these. Uh, let's give these to. Let's see. Hmm. Who should be the miner? I might have this guy take these on. He can't carry any very many more subsystems though. So maybe I'll just give them over to our big guy. Now you can take subsystems now. That's another new feature that I added, but you you can't give them if you don't have any crew, which we don't. And I don't want to break up this food harvesting just yet. So let's have him sit tight for a little bit. And we'll uh Okay, we're done taking crew off this station, so maybe Maybe what we can do now, we'll keep giving crew. Maybe you can just take, take, uh, I'll take, let's just take these miners, and then you can fly over and give your crew to him while that happens. Okay, cool. Good. End the turn. Okay, done done acquiring that stuff. And um, what else happened? We found another ship. What's on it? Two research pods, that's great. That is great. We'll uh, we'll take them we'll put them on this ship once we get these once we get these miners. Okay. Alright, silencers are here. And <laughs> Okay, we have one set one fighter bay to fight off these silencers. Let's start the jump, because I don't really have enough uh, me to really fight this guy. We definitely want these research pods. So I'm going to take this. Oh, this is a bad place to do this jump um, because it'll be too close to... Okay, we'll start the jump from here. You're transferring a miner, but there isn't a miner left. So, don't do that. Instead... Instead... Take... Instead, take the skimmer. Okay, good. I do want those research pods. Okay, I just actually ended the turn by accident, but that's okay. We're going to 
the scavenge. You're gonna continue to harvest food, that's fine. You're in range of the jump, that sucks. Let's move. Okay, so let's start the jump from here. Definitely far enough away. And... Okay, that's done. Now the reason I'm leaving these ships behind if you're if you're kinda new to this is that each ship costs fuel to jump it and uh, we don't want to waste fuel on ships we don't really need so that is why I want to leave these ships behind and not not take them with us. Okay and we're gonna go ahead and end this turn. You can see a silencer creeping around here not super worried about it. What I am worried about is getting my uh, this guy in range of the jump. Actually, it's not really worth being worried about. It's kind of worth being worried about. Let's take any subsystems. Let's take these research pods before we go. That's empty. Empty. And empty. Okay, so those ships are deserted. And it's just a matter of getting out of here now. And this turn, we took research pods. Let's let's start moving. I'm, I'm a little bit paranoid of this. Two, and we're in range of the jump. We have one more day. Uh,